Botox is the number one cosmetic procedure in the United States. It's a medication that's injected into the muscle of facial expression. In general, Botox is injected to the area between the eyes where you have these 11s or lines when you start crinkle your brow. When you raise your eyebrows to animate your face, you'll also get transverse wrinkles across the forehead. And then when you smile, you have crow's feet. People are oftentimes concerned about Botox because they've read it's a botulism toxin and can it harm them? The answer is no, the dose is extremely low. The effect is very subtle, uh, but powerful. So in general terms, uh, Botox is being used at an earlier age, not only to reverse the wrinkling process, but also to prevent. And so my best results are in patients that have been coming to me for years, primarily to prevent. Uh, if you can prevent a wrinkle from ever forming, you've won the battle. Having said that, you know, there's no point along the aging process where it's too late. I have a lot of patients on the other end of that spectrum who feel like they've waited too long, and that's not the case at all. There's always something that can be done. But in general terms, Botox would be something that a woman in their 20s and 30s would start and continue. When you get into more advanced gravitational aging in the face, you would look at facelifting, and that would be anywhere from late 40s, early 50s, into the mid 60s. One of the things we try to te teach our patients is um, things to do to prevent aging. The no two best things you can do are not to smoke and to help avoid sun exposure. That will help tremendously. Doing Botox and fillers helps. Excellent medical grade skin care helps. Uh, and then having a plan throughout your life is something that we can help you with.